Hello everybody, my name is Cool Blue and I'm bringing you all this video of me playing a board game. Uh, oop, this is slightly off frame. Uh, and this game I'm going to be playing today is going to be Botnik, or Botanic, uh, however you pronounce that. I'm going to be playing the solo variant of this game, so I'm going to be playing against a solo bot that has logic. I have the bot's logic printed out here for the virtual player, so I will be reading that off screen. And uh, no worries on how it works. If you want, I'll put the link in the description if you want to get to the rules yourself. But I will be repeating this a lot during the game of the bots logic because it's just the way I play board games apparently. Just announcing everything I'm doing. So uh, we have here the board. I put all my tiles in a bag. So I like to play this as a bag pulling game. But you can do what the game normally suggests, which is to take all the tiles and stack them face down like so into face down stacks. Oh, got a piece way over here. I didn't pick that up from the review. Um, <laughs> sorry. And I'm going to go and shuffle these up. Uh, the goal of this game is for me to score the most points. I score points for every flower that I have on a normal pipe. And then for a end cap, I will score three points because there's three flowers on it. If it's connected to a pipe of the same color. And um, also I will lose points. Or, sorry, I don't lose points. But ultimately I want to have everything connected to my central pipe. I start with this. For the bot, the bots will score points or rack up points just kind of casually. The bot's not going to actually build out a structure, but I had to build out a structure and follow rules for that. So I'll just stack the bot's pieces in uh, individual stacks. There's five colors, so it'll be five stacks, presumably by the end of the game, unless I can somehow prevent the bot from getting all the colors. And um, I also will score points for each contiguous section of pipe. That makes the most sense to me, so I'm going to follow that. The rulebook is a little bit vague on that, so don't quote me on that as far as one of the rules. But I will score points for each contiguous pipe that's connected of the same color. And by that, I mean connected to each other. And uh, the longer of a run I can get, the more points I'll get. And like I said, the rules are a little bit vague on that as far as if that's how you're supposed to score. But it makes sense to me. And also, last time I played this game against the bot, I won by one point. And that was because I scored the way I scored. So I'm just going to go with that because otherwise the bot's very, very aggressive. Like in a non-aggressive way. All right, first thing we do is we're going to fill in the middle here with five tiles. So I'll do that. Five random tiles from the bag. One, two, three, four, five. Oh, I didn't see that. And uh, in a game against the bot, I'm always the first player. So I'll be the first player. So I will be the first one to be able to pick from the river. So we go here. We set the river up. We draw three tiles. And we'll place those three tiles over there. And I'll try to keep this bag um, somewhere where you can see me drawing so you know I'm not stacking the deck or anything. But also, I need space, so I'll keep it there. Alright, so I get to choose my first tile, and um, right out the back, I do want to kind of go for the flower. Uh, the bot's logic, the bot will always go for the, the tile with the most flowers, which in this case will be that one. And then if there's a tie, the bot will go for the one with the most exit points, which is uh, one of these. And then if there's a tie between there, the bot will still ch will choose the one furthest to the left. So if I... so. If I don't take this, the bot's going to get that. And the bot will just score all flowers. Uh, just flat out all flowers. And they'll also score one point for every tile that they get. So that means that I really need to take that from the bot. I don't want to, but the game forces me to. Uh, and then the bot's going to take the yellow one, which I want. So it's going to put me in a little bit, little bit of a predicament. So kind of knowing what the bot's going to do, I could try to hedge my bets. And maybe get myself set up to where I have a lot of exit points. And just let the bot just concede the three points. Because the bot's going to take this, and I'm going to get those two. I feel, I feel like that's a worthwhile investment. We'll see if that comes back to bite me in the butt later. So I'm gonna take that and put it here. Now the bot's gonna take this, and when the bot takes the tile, uh, so first the bot selects based on which one has the most flowers, and then the pipe inch exits, like I said before. And when it comes to placing, the bot will try to place the tile here, wherever it can. It will prioritize putting it in a spot where I don't have a tile on the other side, which it has no legal places to put it over here. And um, if it can't, <clears throat> then it'll put it here in a spot where my tiles are, if, if that's the only choice for it, and if that's not an option, then the bot will resort to putting stuff in the middle, and the bot will always try to release tiles that they have that have the most, uh, that give them the most flowers. And if that's a tie, they go for the most uh, pipe exits. If that's a tie, then they'll go for, oh, well, sorry. They, they try to go for one with the most flowers first, and if that's a tie, actually, let me just read the sheet. It's right, literally right here in front of me. Uh, for liberating tiles, the bot will try to do the tile with the most flowers, and if there's no flowers, then the one with the most pipe outputs, and if there's no pipe outputs, a column where placing it will liberate, uh, sorry, placing it liberates another of their tiles, and then if that's, if that's tied, a column where placing a botition, to, oh, that's botition, sorry, I'm looking at the wrong one. Uh, the column that has a tile with the most flowers, and if, that's an, if there's a tie for that or there's no flowers, 
Then select the Bautician. So Bautician is a little special tiles that can come out. And then if that's a tie, then go for the one where they release theirs but not mine. And if that's still a tie, leftmost co column, which in this case is bottom. All right, let's make sure we go through that. So Bot's done that, I'm gonna do this. Cool, we're gonna draw three new tiles. Bot's gonna be the first player now. One, two, three. And I'll, oh, by the way, I do I do love this little medallion. Like it's a little it's like cool. Like it's completely useless as a player thing. Like all it is is just to show who's going first. But it feels nice. It's like it's like nice porcelain, nice heavyweight porcelain stuff. Anyway, uh, so now the bot gets to go first. The bot's gonna choose one with the most flowers, which is this one. So they're gonna take this one and they're gonna put it. Uh, so they can put it here or here. Either one is fine. So because these are a tie as far as where they can put it, they're gonna put it there because it's leftmost or bottommost in this particular setup. Um, I can take one of these. Uh, I think because the bot's gonna be forced to release things on the next turn, they're gonna release this one. Uh, so I'm going to place, I'm gonna take this and get it over. Well, I'm gonna have all the color. I don't want all the colors. You know, I'm just gonna have to concede the fact that I'm not gonna be able to get a pipe yet. Uh, and I'm just gonna go ahead and do this. Actually, I am gonna get a pipe because the bot's gonna do this. Bot's taking this tile. They could place it here, but there's no legal place, so I lied, they can't place it there. Uh, they can place it either here or here, and between these two, they're going to go for one of the most flowers first, which is that one. So they're going to get that tile, I'm going to release this, and place it over there, and we're building. So the bot has four points. Not that I'm going to keep track of it the whole time, but I'm just trying to give you an idea of how the points work for the bot. Uh, according to the sheet here, for every tile that they get, they basically get a point, which is really annoying. Right, over to me. Um, hmm. These are not convenient. I don't really want any of this to be released immediately, so I can get a little bit of time to build up a green stack. But I'm getting, a, I'm getting like every color, and I'm not building a proper coalition of colors, if you will. So I think I'll take this green, and I'll take the green bend. I guess it kind of doesn't matter. And the bot's gonna take this one, and then I'm gonna take this one. Bot's turn to go first. One, two, three. All right. Whoo! Bot's definitely going to take this one first and put it there. And I'm going to take. I want this one. More specifically, I don't want the bot to have that one. Uh, neither one has flowers. Um, I don't have. A, I do not have a way to take that tile while also keeping it forever. So I might have to do a release by the looks of it. Uh, that kind of sucks, kind of sets me back a little, but I think if I release that blue T, that might be a better go, or I can take this and put it here and not release anything. That gives the bot a space to put their thing, which I guess ultimately is okay, but if I don't do that, then the bot's going to just release this instead. Actually, the bot's going to release that, because that's the most flowers. Hmm. Hmm. Difficulties here. All right, I'm taking this one and put it here, which means the bot can put that one up there. Eh, I don't. I don't want the bot. I don't want the bot to have a tile. That's the problem. Like the more tiles I, let, I concede to the bot, the less points I score. <clears throat> oh boy. All right. I think I'm gonna have to burn a tile. No, because I need that yellow. Man, I really I really need this yellow to be my tile. All right, I'm just going to do this. It's it's kind of inconsequential, because now the bot's going to take this. There's no legal place for him to put it. So the bot's going to put it here and get the most flowers. And I'm going to get this tile, which is I was kind of dreading that, but here I am. Bot's going to get that. More points for the bot. That's like eight points already. Ah, that was a tough decision. And if you've seen the review, when I mentioned before, like, you know, there's a lot of tough decisions this game makes you make. That's one of the scenarios. It's like, ah. Hey, tough decision. All right. <clears throat> so now I got to decide which one of these tiles I want. I want to build out my yellow. So I think I'm going to take this one and place it here. Now the bot's going to choose between these two. They both, neither one has flowers <clears throat> and both have two outputs. So the bot's going to choose the leftmost, which is this one. There's no place for the bot to, oh, no place for the bot to put it over here. So the bot's going to try to place it to release their highest flower which in this case is this one. 
Uh, that's the only because this one would not release it at all because it's the same color. Uh, this one would release their higher flower, and then it releases this for me, which I'm okay with that. And then finally, we go back to me, and I will put this here. Nope, I'll put this here. And I guess go first. Oop, drew like a billion tiles. Sorry. <coughs> Now see, the bot is going to take this one and place it there. If the bot had an option, it will place it somewhere where it's not going to benefit me, but it doesn't have an option, so I'll take that. And I got these tiles here. I do want to get my blue built up, so I'll put that there. And the bot's going to take this, and, and we'll put it either here or here. Tie, so it puts it there instead. Back over to me. Hmm, so I gotta release something. And I want it to be yellow or black, but that's not in the cards for me right now. So I can start building up my blue coalition. And that could be with the straight pipe. So I don't have to worry about stuff. But then I want more options. So I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take this one and I'm gonna put it here, which is gonna keep the bots tile there and release mine, which is perfect. And I put that there. Now the bot's going to choose this one because it has a flower. Put it there. And then I'm going to take this one and I can do this to release. I don't want that one. Uh, I guess I'll just do this. Ah, see, I, I feel like I'm cornering myself if I do that. But you know what? I'm kind of already cornered already because I have all these full and I really need to get those released. Two, three. So now the bot's turn. And most flowers, so it's gonna take this one, and there's no legal place for him to put it, so it's gonna try to release the one with the most flowers, which is a tie. So now that this tie is gonna try to release theirs but not mine, if they can, and in trying to release theirs but not mine, they're gonna try to do this one. Oh, that's not gonna release theirs either. Uh, so there's no place for the bot to put where it's gonna release theirs but not mine. So therefore, the bot's gonna put it here, which is the leftmost. It's gonna release both of ours the bot would rather not have but I get this which I'd rather not have right now but okay we are dealing with the consequences of our decisions here and I'll put this there and the bot's gonna add it to the stack oh so it's gonna do separate stacks my bad all right cool and then the bot's gonna take this one uh, oh did I go first wait I feel like I did something wrong here Hold on, hold on. Let me let me let me think about what just happened. I feel like I went first. No, the bot went first. So what happened? Oh, I think one of these tiles was not the bots. Uh, I think I'm gonna say this one. I don't know if it was that one. We can check the review. We can check the videos and let y'all review that. But I think I took one of these tiles improperly and added it to the bot stack instead of properly keeping it here or some other nonsense happened but at any rate um, I don't like these I don't like these choices so if this was not what was properly there then the consequences are I don't get what I was gonna go for anyway Ugh. let's see so I need yellow so I can take this and release my yellow force them to keep that and then start bending this way and the boss gonna take this and put it there All right over to me I'm doing okay so far. Ooh, our first partition. Nice, it's a blue partition. Uh, there's nowhere to put it. There's nowhere to put it in. There's a flower. Uh, so I don't want that flower right now, but I think I need to take it. I really don't want this flower, but I need to take it because the bot will get to me points if I, do, if I don't. Now the bot's gonna go between these two. They want the most outputs. Oh, let me see. Let's see. So the bot will select a tile with the most flowers. If there are no tiles of flowers, then the bot will take the one with the most, uh, wait. If there are no tiles of flowers, okay, there's no tiles of flowers, so they're gonna take the botition. And they're gonna take the botition. There's nowhere to put the botition. So now they're gonna try to release the one with the most flowers. Uh, there are multiple with the most flowers. So now they're gonna try to release one that's gonna release theirs, but not mine, which is this one. It's gonna release theirs, but not mine. And what a waste of a botition. I swear. Uh, so now we're over to me. I have no black tiles. Uh, this is quite the conundrum. 
I think I need to just burn this tile. I can put it over here. Yeah, I'll, I'll burn this tile like so. Actually, I'll put it here. That way, uh, if the bot does another botition, then there's no, like, bot. There's, there's not as many tile, tile options. Because the botition takes up a spot. One, two, three. The bot gets to go first. I'm going to choose most flowers, this one, and know where to put it. Uh, legal, can't put it there. Um, so, they're going to try to release their one with the most flowers, which is this one and this one. And then they're going to try to release... So they have no choice. This is actually the only one they can release. Because if they put it here, it's going to release nobody's. So they're going to put it here to release theirs, which releases mine, which is very unfortunate. I'm going to I'm gonna try to hedge my bets and put this here and then get it to connect. Because I want more options. I don't want to disrupt the flow, uh, as they say. But in order for that to work, I really need this blue to do something good for me. So I'm going to take this one, put it there. And the bot gets this one. They can't put it anywhere. They're going to try to release their own flower. <coughs> Try to release their own, they want the most flowers, which is this one. So I get this now. And, oh, actually I want to do this. And then they're going to get that. So Bot's, Bot's got some points so far. I'm not too happy about this. I'm very much not happy about this. So now we're going on to my next turn. Uh, I really need that green tea. If I don't take it, the bot will take it. Uh, the unfortunate thing is I don't have any place to put it that's useful. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take the green tea. And then I want to hope a botition comes out. That I can get the green tea later. Because the green tea will be perfect for the spot. Uh, I also need to get black too. But I'll do I'll start the green first. And I'll put this here. Which is unfortunate because it's not going to release anything for me. Actually, I, wanna, I don't, I don't want to give the bot too many options. So I'll do that. And was that an option for the bot? That was not. Uh, let me see. Is there any way for me to put this that's going to limit the bot's options? Yeah, here. So now the bot's going to take one of these two. They're tied. They're both the same tiles. So we're going to take the leftmost. And there's no place for the bot to put it because I put it. I designed it that way. So now they're going to try to release their one with the most flowers. There is one with. No, there is not one with flowers. So now they're going to try to release theirs but not mine. There's no option. So their only last option is to just put it there or leftmost. Uh, that can release for them. That's gonna release for me, but not them. It's gonna release for me and not them. So man, there's a, I put the bot in a really horrible spot. That's great. So they don't release themselves. They release mine though. Ah, I don't want this. <laughs> I don't want this right now. <laughs> oh no. I played myself. <laughs> I played myself, y'all. Uh, all right. Um, cause I want that tea. Gosh, that's unfortunate. Holy cow, that's unfortunate. Uh, I'll put it here. No, I don't want to. I don't want to limit myself too much over here. You know. Uh, I'll put it way up here and just kind of expect that I'll just lose that tile. Uh, it's like almost off the screen. You can you can barely see it. Boss gonna take this and oh, I'm gonna take this. Sorry, I'm gonna take this and I'll just put it there because I want, I want I need my black tiles. Ooh, a partition. Perfect. Oh no, I don't have any putter. Put them. No. Curse you game. Bot's gonna take this one because it has the most flowers. And then for me, <sighs> there's truly nowhere to put this. This is, this is devastating. Devastating, I tell you. I'm gonna take this T because I can at least put it there. And then the bot's gonna take the botition because there's only one left. And there's nowhere to put them legally. So they're gonna put it in the middle, release their flowers, which is this one, which is, ooh, that's, that's just a, Dagger through the heart. Right there. I just gave him. That's four points right there. That's four points. Four whole points. Well. Can I get a partition? I don't know. Alright. I got another chance at some flowers. I have no reds. Which is I'm okay with. But I really need to figure out this connection situation. Uh, I think I need to get my blacks moving along. So I'm going to take this one and put it here. To release this. Let me, let me hold on before I commit to that. Because the bot's going to take this instead. Which I'm okay with. This is a point. I mean, it's, it's, it's inconvenient to me. But I'm okay with that. Alright, so I got my I got my blacks going a little bit. So I can start doing some stuff over there. The bot's going to take this one. It's going to have nowhere to put it. Oh, no. Can put it there. I'm going to take this one and I uh, have nowhere to put it. So I can release my tile, but not theirs. Great. I do want to get this going. 
And we got some uh, variety now, finally. One, two, three. Uh, ooh, plenty of options. Tie, leftmost, this one, nowhere to put it. Uh, they're going to be sad. Release a flower, no flowers. Release uh, their most pipes, this one. Also, it affects me too because I'm not getting anything. And I can take that one now. And I actually do want this one, yeah. That's a great one. Bot's going to take this one. Nowhere to put it. So I'm going to put it in the middle. Release the most pipes. Flowers, no flowers. Sorry, release the most flowers, no flowers, most pipes. Uh, they're both tied, so now they're going to try to benefit themselves and not me. Uh, this is the only place they can put it to get anything. Uh, because that one, they're going to benefit nobody. So they get another tile, and I get my nice black tile. Ooh, I, I don't want to do that. Uh, I do want to do this, though. So I can get my... So I have to put a... I have to put a T or a corner. I can't put a four-way split with green. Uh, which I guess limits my options a little bit more than I want to, but it happens. Alright, for me... Uh, do I want to invest in red? I don't think I want to invest in... Well, I got a red ready to go. So I guess I should start considering reds. I really need to get this green connected back. I don't know how many tiles I have left in the bag, but it's not feeling like a ton. So I will take this. So that way I, I reduce the bot's points by a little bit. And the bot's gonna take leftmost because these are tied as far as flowers and pipes. And they're gonna take this one and put it there. And then for me, I'm going to uh, I don't want to release my um, black one yet, so I think I'll release the red one. Let's see, because I have this tile, or I can put it here. Yeah, I'm going to put it here, because I need to get this connection going. Which kind of limits me, I'm thinking about it, but I set myself up for building stuff in the future. Into, ooh, a botician! A botician! Ah, the, the bot is distracted. They're going to take that. I get the botician. Oh, I have nowhere to put it. No! <laughs> I do this to myself every time. Oh wait, no, I do, I do. Ah, uh ah, -huh. I do. I got a partition. I got a partition. Look, 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 it's right there. <laughs> Sorry, I shouldn't be that excited over a random piece. Um, the boss gonna take this. Most flowers. They're gonna. Oh, yeah, they're gonna go there. Release this. Release this. And now I got to decide if I want to cap off this and just doom this uh, green pipe up here, or if, well, actually, it's the only place I can put it if I want to score points. So I'll put it there. Four points. It's not bad. Back over to me. Another botician. Nice. Oh, two botticians. Uh oh. Alright. Welp. I'm definitely going to take that flower one. And I got to figure out if there's anywhere beneficial for me to put it. Hmm. I can let the bot get one point and then get a tile that I really need. So I, th I, think, that's, I think that's worth it at the end of the day. I'll do this. And I'll get the botician. The bot's going to get this piece. And with this botition, the way it works is I get to swap this with another tile that's in the middle. So I'll swap it here. And then I will put this piece right over here. So I got my connections going. The black is going to be scoring a lot for me, which is pretty nice. The bot's going to choose this one because leftmost, they're both tied. I'm going to put it there. Actually, I can put it in the spot. They'll put it there. And finally, I get this one, and I'll put them there. So I got another botition in the pipes here. One, two, three. And over to me, or over to the bot. They're going to take this yellow because most flowers. And then over to me. Uh, I guess I want the black one. I guess I, I don't, I kind of don't care, do I? I don't care about either of those. If I get the blue one, then I can get some more. Pi oh, oh, I don't have any space to put them to claim. So what can I release that's useful? Hmm. Oh boy, this is uh, mighty inconvenient. Okay, so I, I really need to get this green released. <clears throat> and then, fingers crossed, I can get a green tea. Fingers crossed I can get a green tea. So, because uh, otherwise, uh, I'm gonna be like, cut off this section and have to build another green. Or commit to connecting that to the pipe structure. Uh, you know, there's, there's nothing wrong with trying to commit to connecting that to the pipe structure, because yellow's going on for long enough, right? I don't have any yellow flowers in the pipe. Uh, this is actually fine. So what I'll do is I'll take this, and I will release... Uh, wait, can I release in such a way that the bot gets nothing? Uh, 
I was going to try to release my Botician, so I can take that flower tile and do some flower things with it with my flower friends. But I'm thinking I'm just going to, because I don't want the bot to get too much going. But if I put this, well, it doesn't matter. Bot can do that anyway. So I'll put this here. I'm just going to release my tile. And this red T is not the most convenient, but I'll put it up here because it's going to give me more connection options. That way I can try to get it connected up. And then if I do get that green flower with my Botician, I can um, at least uh, get some more points and then maybe connect this later on. Bot's going to take this one, put it there. Uh, pretty much standard affair. Uh, ooh, oh, 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 we're, we're next. We're to the next last round. I feel it. This is, oh no, I don't have no time to connect everything, y'all. Oh man, this might be a major, major disappointment here. All right, I'm definitely taking this because I really need to get this connected. And I don't care how I get that connected. I just need, because that's going to give me points. Then I'll be fine. And now the bot's going to take this one because it's most flowers. They have nowhere to put it legally. So I have to release some stuff. They're going to try to release their most flowers, which is this one. Uh, oh, they can't because it's not going to release. So now they're going to try to release a... Let's see. Uh, for... Liberation. Let's see. Tile placements. A column where you don't have a tile if possible. Even the leftmost column. Oh no, liberate. Sorry, here we are. Liberate. Uh, a, column where, a column where the bot has a tile with the most flowers. Which is this one, but this tile won't do it. So sadly, they can't. Uh, if there's no tiles with flowers, select the Botician if possible. Oh man, that sucks. Because they're going to release their Botician and not mine. Rude. So I get their Botician. And I think when it comes to what they take, they're going to take uh, the tile with the most flowers. If, they're, if it's tied or no flowers, the tile with the most pipe outputs. If it's tied, a column where... Oh, it says if tied or no flowers, the pipe with the most outputs. Okay. So these are tied, so so the bot's not going to go for that. It's going to instead go for the tile with the most outputs, which is this one. Which seems weird for the bot logic, but okay. And that's going to release this for me. It's going to release this for the bot. And then over here to me, um, I have a lot of thinking to do. Because I really need at least, like, if I can just get that connected. That's going to give me a lot of points. If I can get it connected with the green, that'll be great. But I doubt I'll be able to do that. So last turn of the game. Oh, there's the T I need. Oh, it's looking good, y'all. Oh, I'm not going to be able to get it. I uh, only got one placement. Ugh. That's rough. That's really rough. I'm about going to take this one. There's no legal place to put it on their side. So they're going to put it in the middle. They're going to try to release their most flowers, which is this one. They won't release if they do that. So they're going to try to release theirs, but not mine, which is here. And now I got, I got a dilemma. I got quite the dilemma. If I could somehow get this to be my tile, then I would be golden. But what I can try to do, because I don't think I'm allowed to like dig through the tiles and figure out what they are. I think this is a green flower under here. Or another green flower. But I can try to kick a gamble. Or I can go for the short thing. If I go for the gamble, the gamble, because these are not going to score me anything anyway, which is why I can barely see them. But if I take the gamble, the gamble is to release my Botician and then replace my Botician. Well, actually, it would be the same thing, wouldn't it? Replacing my Botician with that Botician wouldn't do anything. It's not going to chain the way I want it to. Heck. Yeah. I, th I, think, I think there's only one move for me to go. I'm going to take this one with the most pipes. Because this one, oh, that was, that's going to release theirs, isn't it? Uh, I'm going to get two points for that. I mean, I'm going to get more points, but still. All right, fine. I'm committed to that. Because the, the other decisions for me to, the other decisions for me to release my Botician and then take this tile, which might still release their tile anyway. And that would be nice because it gives me more points for the blues over here. But at this point, I think I need to just, just kind of go with the points I have. So it's going to release this. I'm putting it there for sure so I can get that connected. And it's going to release that, which is unfortunate. And the bot's going to take this and do nothing with it. It doesn't matter. And that's it. <clears throat> so now let's figure out who won this particular game. Um, I don't have much hopes for myself, but we'll see. We'll count the bot score first so we can keep the suspense going. 
So the bot essentially gets one point for every tile released. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. Paper, where's my pen? I don't know where my pen is. All right, cell phone it is. All right, so the bot's gonna get 15 points from that. I really can't find that pin. That's unfortunate. Oh, it's over there. Yeah, it's too far away. So 15, and then the bot's gonna get one point for every flower. So one, four, seven, eight, uh, 11, 12. Whew, that's 14, no, 15. 16, 17, wow. Plus 17, oof. So they got 32 points. Oh man, oh no. All right, y'all, this, this might be, this is gonna be, I don't know if I got 32 points. That doesn't look like 32 points to me. So for me, I'm gonna get rid of all these tiles here that I did not connect. So they're gone, they're gone out of the game. And then uh, I'm gonna score points based on my flowers. All of my um, plants are watered. So I'm gonna count all my flowers immediately. So just one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So I got nine. And one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. Yep, I lost. Cause this is no there's no way that's 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 high enough. I'm at like Yeah. That's rough. <laughs> that's rough. So I'm at 23 points to the bot's 32. All right, and that is, um, that's the game. That's the solo game. As you can see, I kind of, I was doing great until I wasn't. I think I kind of committed a little bit too hard to getting these colors continuous. I should have uh, adjusted to reds because I, I had a bunch of reds I didn't do much with. And when I was building the tiles up here, that's essentially potentially three points that I lost. I mean, I don't think those three points would have given me much. But the concession of giving the bot um, some more of those extra flowers, I think that's that's what did me in. The bot got too many of those fancy flowers, and I didn't plan enough for those. So yeah. So that's pretty much it for the game. Um, I enjoy this game because it's fun and it's kind of straightforward. You know, you just kind of sit down, play your tiles, and it's also visually visually it looks nice. Um, I don't think it's the prettiest game in the world, but it definitely looks nice. And there's not there's nothing. There's nothing wrong with having a good table presence as far as the art and the style and the things. It looks approachable too. And the mechanics are, you know, while a little bit advanced as far as what they do, if you try to really chain it together. Cause like if I have a situation to where I get this and then I take this partition and then I take this, take a tile that's gonna cause something else to release and that causes something else to release. And it's like, like you can chain stuff. Like there's some cool things you can do with it. Um, but on the same token, it's not overly complex to where it's too much to go with. You know, it's a very simple, straightforward game that gives you a lot of perilous decisions. In my particular case, you saw the perilous decisions I had to face, and um, the bot cheated. The bot obviously cheated. Didn't connect any any of their pipes correctly. Just got points. This is this is outrageous. This is outrageous. <laughs> Anyway, jokes aside, uh, that's it for this game. Hope you all enjoyed it. Definitely let me know in the comments below what you think of the game. And uh, if you want a nice two-player game, go for it. This game reminds me a lot of Lost Cities, minus the Lost Cities part. Um, it's not that I hate Lost Cities. Um, my, my mom actually enjoys playing Lost Cities, so I play with her uh, whenever I can. But I feel like this could be a nice supplement to Lost Cities instead of just playing Lost Cities all the time. So um, we'll see. We'll see how that goes in the, in the upcoming holidays in 2022. So, yeah, thank you all very much for watching. Hope you all enjoyed it. And as always, I will see you all whenever.